So you, you have a minute to think about it. And then like 20 to talk. <laughs> yeah, you can just want. Yeah. Uh oh, me talking as much as I want? We could be here for the next 20 years. My name is Peter, and I'm a staff member here at UCP, and I've been here for 14 years now. Good day. <laughs> <laughs> when they earn a piece of, uh, when they earn, I'm sorry, gotta do it Go again. Ahead. No, we can cut it out. So just okay. Keep going. okay. Being a staff member here is really cool because you get to see people, especially being here for an extended, extended period of time, you get to see people grow and you get to see people change, which is really cool because you can see somebody uh, take so many steps in a wonderful direction like we have our homebound program which does a lot of exercise therapy and it's really neat to see people uh, grow within that, being able to just not necessarily maintain the abilities that they have but also expand upon them so you can see people that just like have been in wheelchairs that use walkers and now uh, a lot of people just use canes like they're able to walk a lot more with the, like the use of Facebook people just being able to communicate easier we have a lot of uh, technology back in the computer lab that is really very cool because it allows people to have a voice when they wouldn't be able to have one before. Why do you think it's important for people in the community to know what you do here? Because it, because it shows a different perspective of people with disabilities. It shows us that we're it it shows us that we can do everything everybody else can do. You know what I mean? And it opens up different opportunities too. It makes it you know, like when you when you see us, you're like, wow, they're capable of doing everything we can do. You know. And I, that's the perspective that I've always had because it goes back to my father. He told me that, you know, everything on it, you know, your body doesn't work, but your mind works like that. It can, it, you can do whatever you want. The thing that's also really interesting is I don't think anybody here sees anybody else with a disability. They pretty much just see like if someone was in a wheelchair or somebody you know, was uh, paralyzed something like that. They don't see that. They don't see their disability. They just see them as like, hey, there's there's Ron, there's Tina. They're just, you know, normal. And we don't treat them, we don't treat the students here like they have a disability because they don't. They're just like us. They're just, you know, a little bit different. There is but, a yeah. commission and um, basically they do like the wind shines, the mosaic, drawings, ceramic pieces and the neat thing about it they get to earn a commission out of all of this and um, they get to earn uh, like sometimes they want to buy something that they want for Christmas like see anything that we're selling right now um, they're excited because um, they get to buy something for something of, something of their own or something they might want to buy something for their loved one it could be their parents it could be their care provider that they love but basically it's all fun it's helping like rely on myself a little bit because I, I I like help but I'd rather be independent you know because one thing this is the only thing I changed with disabilities is like people either do one or two things with us it's like they over help or they under help they don't like they don't ask like, do you need it? They just see, see the chair and like, let's help, you know? It's like, that's the one thing I tell people out there is don't over help. Like, we, we are more than capable to speak for ourselves if we need it. Just let us, let us speak for ourselves. It's completely changed my perspective. Like, I, like I've been saying, like, you don't, I don't see anybody with a disability anymore. I just see that, like, you know, they may be in a wheelchair, but that's not really holding them back in any way. So it's completely changed my mind. Have a whole lot of fun in that you can find us out in the community and that we, we really look out for each other and that it's a family atmosphere. Um, come and see us, what we're all about. 
uh, come and see our students, come and see the art, come and see our center. Um, we have a lot for you guys to come and see what we do, what they do. And I think that's the fun thing about it, that we get to enjoy what they're creating and what they're doing and what they show us also, what they can do.